Hey everybody, it's Chris and Dez Show. I'm Chris. And I'm Dez. And we're driving. And we just literally just saw the Lehman Trilogy at the Amundsen Theater in Los Angeles. And, and we want to talk to you about it. Yes, because let me tell you, it is so good. Uh, it is a very long play. And when I found out how long it was, I was concerned. Because there's two intermissions. And so it, wait, it's five, it's after 5.30 right now. It ends, of, it went from two o'clock to 5.30. Yeah. So it's a significant amount of time that you're investing in going to see this play. But I am telling you, it is worth it. Get your butt to the theater. If you liked, it's just compelling storytelling. Yeah, it's it is so good so if you liked Hamilton and the history part about Hamilton that is what I would entice you with about this play it's history it's the history of the Lehman Brothers which is a financial corporation and it was so first of all the story of these brothers coming to America is so compelling in the first place just the story itself and then the set is impressive, the backdrop, the special effects are impressive, and it's told, the story, this play, is just three guys telling it. And they change characters in it and stuff, because the story spans so many years, but it was so good. It was so good. Christopher, what did you think? <laughs> yeah, no, I totally agree with this. I, we were, uh, we were like hesitant. We have seen another three and a half hour, four hour show, and it was not good. And no. so we have been scarred yeah. with PTSD <laughs> with from it. Two days journey. And two days. <laughs> and so we were like, oh no. And Desi was like, maybe we should be open to leaving after the second. Yeah, let's let's keep whatever. our options open here. Uh, and then literally, we get to the first intermission, like, oh my gosh, it's so good. It was I'm, amazing. I'm in. I am. In it was so good. The Adam Godley and Simon Russell Beale are the they're two of the brothers and they're from the Broadway production. They are phenomenal. I mean, these three guys are on the sh on the stage on the for stage. three and a half hours, yeah. so they are crazy good. Um, the other guy was Howard Overson. He's very good too. They're all three great, and they're playing all these parts and stuff. I love Adam Godley. I've seen him in a bunch of other stuff too, film and TV and stuff. He's so good and they're all so good they, it's they're so compelling the writing is so they even do the like it's sometimes first person they're talking sometimes third oh, yeah. person yeah. it's a really interesting way of like getting you and hooking you in the whole entire time it's just so great and there's one piano player she's off to the bottom her. like she's down on the she's not on the stage she's kind of down but yeah. you can see her She's she's visual, so she, she's not down in the pit. Rebecca Bruce. Oh my gosh! And she's playing the whole time. It's like if you're at a like when there was movies, but there was silent no sound. Films, yeah, yeah, silent films. Mm -hmm. And there's just someone, and it's so much better when it's live like that. So she's free. Like if they skip a line or something, she she can roll with them because she's live and yeah. she's right there. She's so good. It was it was just so yeah. everything good. about it is compelling. There is no. To clarify about the Hamilton, there is no music. It's not a music. No, it's not a musical. Yeah, it's a play. Good, good, good point. Yeah, and so if you like, like, oh, I love the songs. Like, well, then this isn't going to no. be similar. But it is a history lesson. I was going to say, what play is like this that I seen? Kind of maybe like War Horse and things like oh, that, yeah, where it's yeah, like yeah. a history play like that. Um, really good. It's long, but worth the investment. And it does not feel long. The time goes are, right on by. Yeah, like it, it just flies by because it is good storytelling. So it just opened yesterday at the Amundsen. At the Amundsen. Today is March the 25th. Today is March 5th. Oh. Today is March the 5th. 2022. 2022. Go see it. Get your tickets Go now. Tickets. It just It's coming straight from Broadway. It yeah. just closed on Broadway January 2nd. And that set it's, oh, you know oh, it's straight. Oh. It's just straight from Broadway. It's so good. It's so, it's so good. really good. So, we told you. We so, said, go see this. We went and saw it with Lauren Graham from Gilmore Girls. Yeah, Lauren Graham was just down down Lauren, the row a little bit. We couldn't sit together because there weren't seats together. But, uh, <laughs> Lauren uh, and Des and I, we all liked yeah, it. Yeah, we all did. I bet you she did, for sure. <laughs> so, go see it. We recommend it. Lauren Graham recommends it. It's, it's two thumbs up from us. It. Really big. Yeah, let us know what you think. Like, subscribe. Tell your mailman. Tell your mailman. All right. <laughs> Bye. Bye.